you guys think that we can control the drone bit with the micro bit radio waves? So let's try that out. But before that, I need to remind you guys about safety equipment. You guys should always wear safety equipment when trying things like this. The safety equipment you should wear is probably safety goggles. So let's try it out. Let's place the drone bit on the ground. And now, if we press button A, it should fly. And as you guys can see, it is flying. And now if we press button B, it is going to land. Guys, it is amazing how we can use the micro bit radio waves to control the drone bit. But it's only landing and taking off. What if we want to move it forward or backward? Maybe even left and right. So I have some secret. This is called the joystick bit. With the joystick bit, we can do all of those things and more. So let's plug in the micro bit to the joystick bit. First, remove the USB cable. And now we just slide this in. So if we turn this on, we should turn off the drone bit and then turn it back on for it to connect. So if we turn this off, we wait a few seconds, then we turn it back on. Now it should connect. So now let's try it out. First, we gotta make it take off and then remove it. As you guys can see, we have many buttons on the joystick bit and we can try all of them. So let's test some more of it. Let's make it take off. As you guys can see, it's taking off. And now let's use the joystick. As you guys can see, with this we can make it move in every direction. But now let's press button C. <laughs> and as you guys can see, our drone just Tokyo drifted, but it's a drone. Not even a car. So as you guys can see, uh, the drone is incredible. Guys, let's open this up. You guys can see this is super dope and it's so nice and now I can play Minecraft with this and as you guys can see all we need to do is just slide the micro bit right here um, and now let's go right into the programming how does a micro bit communicate with another micro bit they communicate using radio Radio is a way of transmitting and receiving messages over a distance. The micro bit can use radio waves to communicate between other micro bits. In order to generate and detect these waves, the micro bit has an antenna on top of the board, which should be right here. And we can program the micro bit to use this radio feature. While one device transmits or sends a message, the other device receives and can be programmed to send back. And to avoid interference from other micro bits sending messages, we can program this micro bit to send messages in a specific group and only the group members can send messages. So now we have to program the joystick bit to send messages to the drone bit and we have to program the drone bit to receive these messages and send back other messages. So let's check the code out. So guys, this is the code for the joystick bit. And as you guys can see, it's a little long, but it will all be worth it. And this is the code for the drone bit. It's also a little long, but it's also very worth it. And I will be adding these codes down below in the description. If you guys like this video, please leave a thumbs up. And if you guys don't mind, subscribe. Also, remember to share this to some of your friends or maybe even family members. And I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.